they feel like you anti-American, then maybe you, it's time to really take a look at this, Vasquez. I know you're, I, I see you as a good man. However, Ugh. accountability is what I stand on. Yeah. And for the last month, let's, let's just put in account the last 120 days that I've suffered. Still homeless, countless SR numbers, but I watch individuals who came, who have come from thousands of miles away get preferential treatment. Mm -hmm. Whereas, I mean, I'm 43 years old. I live in this, um, um, how, how would you say it in Espanol? Um, Mia um, Sukasa, this is my home. Yes. Chicago, this is my home. I'm 43 years, this is my home. Yes. This is our home. Our, yes. However, we've been pushed to the wayside, it seems, yes. by our legs. So I can see them screaming down your necks. <laughs> Look, and it's heavy, ain't it? It's hard, to, the, the reality of having this many individuals come out and share with y'all the hardships that they going through and have been going through. So kudos to the media. Yes. Thank y'all. However, in a, in, a, in a place where you want to say something nice about Brandon Johnson, you're not here today. Right. In a place where you want to say something about the election, or you want to say something about the people who chosen to just disregard the American citizens of Chicago, the residents who pay taxes, who stand. This man said the illegals got cars and they do. I watched them ride through 100 uh, in the far south side without license, without insurance. Right, However, right. I now have license and insurance. I, I, no, no, I don't have a license because it's been taken from me. Oh. My insurance I can't cover because I don't have a job. Mm. And if you don't have a base to, to, to basically set yourself up like a home or housing, then you set to the wayside. Right. These are all realities that citizens here in this um, Chicago are suffering. Uh, the, well, basically the country. So I want to say the country. That's what we're suffering right now. This is the reality of us. I'm the reality. This young woman is the reality. Blake Moore, um, Jessica, all of us. Gage Park residents, all of us. This man here with his wife. So if you're going to, and, and the Second Amendment says guns, y'all considering giving illegal people, we don't even know anything about. Oh, oh, guns. 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 They gave it to us. They gave it to us. You know what, I'm going to have to go through so much paperwork, and y'all going to be like, no, we can't get a black man no gun. However, y'all done said we going to get these people guns, but we stand to protect ourselves even. Y'all look, what is this? Right. This is a removal of the American citizens while y'all move a whole new um, people went to the city? Try, what is going on? Right. Honestly, what is going on? The reality of us is if we continue to allow this to go on, then we will be displaced. Not only displaced, raped, murdered, pillaged. Yeah. This is the reality. Without this, a city without walls has no defense. And we got no walls. We got no walls in our legs. No walls. So understand this. A city without walls has no defense. And we got no walls. That's right. Thank you. Thank you. There you go. That's what you say. You smelling that red backpack. Oh.